seeing drones flying overhead is sure to be a regular occurrence in the coming years. Already, aerospace engineering firms are showing off their prototypes, and the major aircraft companies are demonstrating the capabilities. These drones come in two types, the model based on airplanes, currently in use for military purposes, and helicopter-style drones used for lifting cargo and surveillance. Welcome to Nerdy's Top 10. Before watching the video don't forget to subscribe us for more and do leave your thoughts in comments. Up in our list is the Grip Aviation 350. The Grip Aviation 350 is developed by the Grip Aviations is more likely to see use in industrial, military, law enforcement, and search and rescue applications. One of the important features of the GRIP 350 drone is easy to transport, assemble, and operate. It can carry around 500 pounds 226 kilograms of payload weight. It is equipped with an 8-propeller UAV with a very high power and can sustain 45 minutes of airtime. It has a maximum flight speed of up to 60 km per hour and maximum flight distance up to 15 km. Next in our list is the Boeing Cargo Drone. The Boeing Cargo Drone is an unmanned, fully electric cargo air vehicle. It was made possible by an investment of Boeing Horizon X Ventures. At the beginning it was remote control operated, but then changed to autonomous flight and can be controlled by a software. Equipped with six dual rotor systems with 12 propellers with a maximum takeoff weight of 499 kilograms and can travel with a maximum speed of 37 kilometers per hour can make cargo deliveries easy. Next in our list is the AT200. China's heaviest cargo unmanned aerial vehicle AT200 is designed to meet cargo transportation needs of both civilian and military operators. The AT200 cargo unmanned aircraft features low-wing monoplane design equipped with 750 HP lightweight, twin-shaft, turboprop engine. This huge unmanned aerial vehicle has a cruising speed of 313 km per hour and can fly to a range of up to 2,183 km with takeoff weights of 1.63 t and also features a 10 cubic meters cargo compartment, which can accommodate 1.5 ton of cargo. Next in our list is the K-Max. The Come On K-Max is an American synchropter with intermeshing rotors by Come On Aircraft. It is optimized for external cargo load operations, and is able to lift a payload of 2,700 kg which is more than the helicopter's empty weight. This aerial vehicle has the version with optional remote control. The Come On K-Max version has been put to work first mostly in war situations, however, it is also used by civilians. The United States Navy used it to deliver supplies to troops during combat. Next in our list is the Feihung 98. Feihung 98 is now the world's largest unmanned transport aircraft, it is a cargo plane retrofitted to operate like a drone. It was adapted from the prototype of the ship AY-5B, a China-developed transport plane. The Feihung 98 has a maximum takeoff weight of 5.25 tons, a maximum capacity of 1.5 tons and a cruising speed of 180 km per hour, and a maximum range of 1200 kms. Next in our list is the Hermes 900. The Hermes 900 is a surveillance, reconnaissance and target acquisition operative UAV, built by Silver Aereo, an Israeli firm. With a 1,500 kg takeoff weight, it can carry up to 350 kg of payload, with long endurance of 30 hrs, at up to 30,000 feet altitude and 200 km range. It provides real-time electro-optic and electronic battlefield intelligence data. Enhanced and fully redundant avionics have been provided to this aircraft as well as fully autonomous flight pattern with in-flight redirection. Next in our list is the General Atomics MQ-20 Avenger. MQ-20 Avenger formerly known as Predator C is a developmental unmanned combat air vehicle built by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the US military. It is powered by a turbofan engine, and its design includes stealth features such as internal weapon storage and an S-shaped exhaust for reduced infrared and radar signatures. 
with a maximum speed of 740 km per hour and an armament of AGM-114 Hellfire missiles and GBU-39, GBU-12, 16 and 31 bombs of total 1,600 kg capacity serves as a good combat drone. Next in our list is the, the Northrop Grumman RQ-4. The Northrop Grumman RQ-4 Global Hawk is a high-altitude, remotely piloted, surveillance aircraft. It was initially designed by Ryan Aeronautical, now part of Northrop Grumman. It can survey as much as 40,000 square miles of terrain per day. Operated by U.S. Air Force for worldwide military operations. It can reach speeds of nearly 629 km per hour and can perform its work from a height of 50,000 feet and is considered as one of the top surveillance UAV. Next in our list is the, the Northrop Grumman RQ-180. The Northrop Grumman RQ-180 is an American stealth unmanned aerial vehicle UAV, surveillance aircraft drone. Only recently has the U.S. military confirmed its existence and deployment in the field. Few details exist publicly on the craft. Did you know? The entire program on the RQ-180 is classified, even the budget used to fund it. The craft is believed to be housed at the infamous Area 51 facility in New Mexico. Next in our list is the EVOM Ravnex drone. Ravnex drone was developed by EVOM it's which is said to be the world's biggest drone. It is now capable of sending low earth orbit satellites into space. The drone is 80 feet long and 18 feet tall and can be driven by EVOM's proprietary software. It has a nominal takeoff weight of 25,000 kg and has top atmospheric speed 1,050 km per hour makes it to be very useful for space military and aviation industry well that's it for today see you again in the next top 10 video stay tuned